Our other top story at this hour, more division at Clark High School. Some parents and students are upset about the recent letter from the new principal. Yeah, he was reacting to criticisms and complaints brought up at last week's Board of Trustees meeting. Many say he's undermining the magnet program, but the principal argues he's trying to raise the standard. Kristen Drummond has the latest. I spoke with many students off camera Tuesday about this letter from Principal Antonio Real. Many tell me they're fearful of retaliation if they do speak publicly, but tell me this was the topic of discussion on campus. People at this point are somewhat scared to speak out even though they want to. But Tina Sanchez bravely raises her concerns. I was actually really upset by the letter. This is a really big deal. Don't try to downplay it. Real states he perhaps made changes too quickly by trying to advance academic opportunities for all students. But some parents find the letter intimidating. I feel like it was an attempt to throw, to throw out all of the minority cards that you could in order to kind of read between the lines, don't come at me because I'm going to play those cards. Real hopes each and every slanderous claim is fully investigated, even stating, I stand with doors open and nothing to hide. He's very charming, but then nothing happens after it, no changes. Despite the accusations, some parents support Real and his policies. I think it's about time he did communicate what he's trying to do. I just think he waited too long to do it. A dividing issue continuing to raise tensions on campus. Sometimes the way you deliver a message is just as important, if not more important, than the message itself. Some Clark High School parents tell me they plan to address the Board of Trustees again at this Thursday's meeting. Kristen Drummond, 8 News Now. We can also tell you that the teachers' union plans to monitor the situation, and a meeting with Rael could happen very soon.